Hey guys, it's Adam Silverman here from AdamDrums.com. Um, I want to take a chance today to answer some questions I've been getting via email um, and on Twitter and Facebook. A lot of people kind of started to asking, um, you know, what is the, what are some things that I work on when I'm home? What are some things that I practice? Um, and this is something that I always work on, and it's a pretty heavily advanced coordination exercise book. Um, it's called The New Breed by Gary Chester, and it is a fantastic book. And I'm going to walk you through some very uh, kind of advanced exercises, but I want to show you some of the ideas from this and kind of explain a little bit about why I work on it. So let me uh, take this chance to show you some of these exercises real quick. All right, the first exercise that I'm going to kind of show you guys a little bit about is just a, it's an advanced ostinato exercise. And so what's happening is the right hand, the left hand, and the left foot are playing a groove. That groove sounds something like this, roughly. It's around 84 BPM as well. So it's a groove. That's the ostinato. That's the basic pattern that we're going to work with. Um, but what you actually do is you learn this ostinato and then there's melody sections on the page of exercises that you run down and that's going to happen in the bass drum kit. So I'm going to play this ostinato with these and them and then I'm going to put the foot in on the melodies that are written over here. And I want to show you guys this. It's really cool. It's really challenging. Um, but I think it's really good for you. So let me hop over here and kind of show you guys. Here's the ostinato. So that's the, ba that's the basic rundown of what you're doing. So I'm basically reading each line once or twice um, because I've worked on these a little bit. Um, and you get used to it. But the basic idea is that you're developing a coordination far beyond what you're normally capable of by reading these exercises down. So in my mind, what I'm thinking about is the relationship between the bass drum foot and the hands that are doing the ostinatos. And I'm basically thinking through that in my head while I'm reading down the exercise. If you don't think this is valuable, you're crazy. Will I ever play this in a groove on stage? Probably not. Am I going to sit in a Lauren Elena concert and be like... <laughs> Probably not. But on the flip side of that, it makes going back to a simple groove, you know, something like Tupelo where I'm... <laughs> that feel a lot easier and it's giving me the independence to not think about what my limbs are doing. I'm not thinking playing my bass drum on this beat and my snare on this beat. I'm just playing what I hear in my head because I've worked on all these kinds of crazy exercises. So for what it's worth, the book is called The New Breed. It's by Gary Chester. It's an incredible book. It takes a lot of patience, but I think it's well worth the time. Check it out. Thanks for stopping by.